Hey there guys, it's me Rob. Thanks for tuning in to the Rob's Knowledge YouTube channel. And today here we have a Toshiba satellite laptop and we're gonna be showing you guys how to get into the BIOS menu. Now this is very similar on other models of Toshiba's. Uh, it may be a little different on different makes of computers. So like a Sony or something, it may be a little different because Toshiba actually has something called a setup utility instead of the traditional BIOS menu that you typically see on most other computers. But you can access most of the same functions throughout that menu. So we're logged into our Windows. This is Windows 10. Now it may be a little different on earlier operating systems and we'll go through some of that. But we're going to show you on Windows 10 because this is the most current system. So you're going to want to have your computer turned on and logged in. And you're going to go ahead and go to your start menu and just type in settings. You're going to want to go to your Windows settings. Okay, now let me zoom in here. So we're on our settings window in Windows 10. You're going to go right here to update and security. And then from here, you're going to want to go to the recovery over here. And then where you see advanced startup, you're going to click restart now. And then it's going to load this for a second. Then you're brought to this menu. Now you're going to want to go ahead and click troubleshoot. And from here, you're going to go to advanced options and UEFI firmware settings is what you're going to want to click. Restart to change UEFI firmware settings. Go ahead and click the restart button and then you will be brought to the Toshiba setup utility. And this is basically your BIOS menu on Toshiba laptops. So from here is where you can know you can change your boot order, stuff like that. Here's your boot order down here in advanced menu. Um, you can also turn on or off secure boot. This is basically where you can do all of your stuff that you would do in your typical BIOS menu. Now, if you're not on Windows 10 and for some reason you don't have access to the actual Windows operating system, like say your hard drive has failed, which I've actually had before, all you're going to do on the Toshibas is you're going to re you're going to power down your laptop, you're going to power it on and as it's power as soon as it starts to power on, just hold down your F2 key. That should bring you to the same menu. If that doesn't work, try the same thing, but try it with the F12 key, and that should bring you to some kind of a boot menu, and then from there you can click to go to the Toshiba Setup Utility. That's about it for this video, guys. I hope this helped you out. If you have any comments, questions, or concerns, as always, feel free to leave them down below in the comment section. Make sure you hit the red subscribe button and turn on your post notifications so you're notified every time I post a new video. Until next time, guys, I will talk to you later. Peace out.